Hello, my fellow miner. Yes, I'm back again. Uh, I was supposed to be watching Star Trek by now, but there are some requests on a quick look on the new LOL Miner version 1.50 beta. So here we have it. And now, all the hash rates just disappeared at the top of the screen. That is perfect. Perfect timing. So here we see a very boring screen uh, with very boring information while waiting for the stat screen. Fantastic. Uh, there we have it. So let's start from the top of the list. The RTX 3060 around 49 megahertz per second, which is a bit slower, half a, say, uh, half a megahertz slower than the usual, I think. The RTX 3060 Ti Hynix Revision 1, also around 1 megahertz slower than the usual. The RTX 3060 Ti Revision 2, I think around half a megahertz say slower there as well um yeah and then we have the rtx uh, 3070 around half a megahertz slower than all the others and so forth and we we have a look at the rtx 3050 we see that it is not unlocked in any way and the same for the 3080 12 gigs compared to um wow i just got disturbed by the mini beast uh, <laughs> Uh, compared to NP Miner 41.4, which actually unlocks those two to 90%. So now that we we have pretty much all the big miners, they have LHR unlock uh, to some degree, I'll say, but only NP Miner has it, uh, where it, it, it includes the uh, 3050 and 3080 12 gigs. So they have kind of cracked the code on LHR completely. We are very close, I guess, to being completely free of LHR. Well, at least until LHR version 4. Now, I don't know why I didn't do this in the previous video. I should have done it. But let's head over and have a look at uh, the HiveOS UI so you can see the overclock settings there and, of course, the temperatures. You can also see the temps here, but I guess the UI is a bit better for that. Now. Before I do that, I just want to say that these quick look videos do not rule out the in-depth videos. I'll still do those, uh, but I figured that I may as well do the quick looks to get you guys into it. And then I'll do uh, um, an in-depth with um, a comparison and, and profits, etc, etc. So let me know in the comments what you think about the quick look videos. And then uh, let's have a look at the HiveOS UI. I honestly don't know why I didn't do this for the G minor quick look. Uh, yes, here we can see the temperatures and fan speed. I'm running at 100% and we can see the memory temps. That is actually what we're interested in. You may also be interested in the overclock settings. You have them here. You can also go check out my T-Rex uh, version 0.26.1 versus MB minor 41.4 beta video which I've also released today. You can also check out the G minor 2.92 quick look video which I have also released today. So there's a lot of stuff for you to, to check out. I'll uh, put them in the description and also the pinned comment. If you like the video then like it. If you want to help me out share the video everywhere and I hope to see you in the next one. Now I'll actually go and watch Star Trek for real. See you in the next one. Maybe.